Eh, that's a stretch, I know. But we're going to try. We're going to try for this month um, to do vlogs every Sunday. Only put off until tomorrow what you're willing to die having left undone. Good morning, happy Monday. So I am off today. Um, I'm just kind of relaxing outside. Just finished uploading a video for YouTube, but I wanted to welcome y'all to the vlog. So thank you so much for clicking on today's video. Um, as y'all saw yesterday, we, it was Easter. So we had Easter egg hunt. The dinner, chef's kiss baby. The dinner was so, 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 so good. Um, and then I was kind of just off off of the camera in, in the moment um, but today I don't really have that much on my agenda per se um, I have a lot of like admin stuff to do emails that type of thing I do need to do my hair though let me just show y'all it's twisted up right now I literally washed it yesterday um, I used the Olaplex shampoo and the oats and protein mask from I'm blanking on the name of the brand child I'm blanking I'll put it across the screen but anyways I finished that product up and then I didn't put any product in my hair so this is like a stretch almost like blow dried with no product type of style I'm planning to do like a protective style but I just didn't have time to do it yesterday so here we are um, but the twists are so cute actually like if you ever need a quick go-to style even if you don't have the length for the hang time you can twist it and then just pin it back and it'll still be a vibe so today i am going to do my hair so yeah i just wanted to welcome y'all to the vlog let me know below if you are brand new to the channel love to welcome the new people if you are og and you back for another one y'all already know the love runs deep baby the love runs deep but um yeah anyways i will check in with y'all probably a little bit later i'm gonna just finish working on some stuff um outside that's why i have this robe on girl it's giving <laughs> granny vibes baby that's what it's giving but one thing about me i'm gonna put a robe on baby and these pajamas are super cute i got them um actually for my bridal shower which was like two and a half years ago at this point <laughs> so shout out to me for still fitting it love that but yeah, I'll check in with y'all later. pretty good uh, don't have a lot sitting on top and that is what I like give me the moisture I need especially after this wash
This is my client today. We're going to be doing a blowout with the Briogeo Farewell Frizz. We still feel the vibe of you could not say a word and I know what you just decided We'd be right in the same wave All the water's perfect, babe The heat is rising, the time is melting from my fingertips So nothing compares to this Nothing ever will compare to this Today was a blowout and I didn't flat iron her hair because she did not need any extra heat and I also didn't trim her ends but this is just not professional. <laughs> it's, it's, I'm brushing on the back you know, I need to be brushing this way this is courtesy of dr. my curl salon look look in the bio for my booking link um, this is a family discounted right here <laughs> meanwhile look at the stylist hair looking like who shot John do you have any last remarks? No, I appreciate the free service. You can get out my chair so now. Shall, Thank I you. I the front like this. Oh, yeah. They didn't put the little thing on the face. There's the front like that. No, they don't. That don't mean the same thing. All right. Yeah. Bye. You and I making fire. I can take you. I can make it better. So we are going for a walk. Just finished doing hair, as y'all saw. <laughs> Meanwhile, I still gotta do my hair. I'm trying to decide if I'm gonna do like straighten it since it's technically it doesn't have any product in it, or if I'm gonna do like mini braids or mini twists. So of course y'all will come along for the process, but this is our last week of the challenge. We're up to 12,000 steps a day. So I forgot it's spring break this week. I'm like, why are all these kids not at school? But I forgot school is not in session. Um, so yeah, just wanted to come on and talk because I felt like it was a lot of B-roll and y'all like, girl, whose hair? What's going on? I literally have my salon. I just got bullied though to do hair that I was not planning to do, but I love doing hair. So it all worked out, but it's such a beautiful day. Oh my gosh. It's such a beautiful day. Like literally walk, going on walks makes my day. But y'all know what I'm about to say. Y'all getting heavy up here. <laughs> also body, body is loading.
girl, you know that. I'm super fat. I ain't on it again. Hey y'all, good morning, happy Tuesday. So I'm actually about to paint my nails. Y'all are at like a, a weird angle, because I got my, here we go. I got y'all on a new tripod, but it's not really new, but anyways, I'm about to paint my toes. And I want to show y'all the color. So y'all saw this on my last vlog, if you didn't, definitely go back and check it out. But this is the Rum Runner from 1002. And then I have two different top coats. I think I'm going to use the gel finish top coat. I also have the super dry, but I'm not really in a rush. So, yeah. y'all we are back so i think my camera died i don't know if y'all saw my nails but this is the final this is the final look they are still growing on me i think because they give oh it's taking a while to focus i think because they give off like silver hues and i'm not really a silver girl the toes are super cute though um i did get a clip of those for y'all so i think i might want to go back and do that color on my nails the same color i did on my toes but anyways i wanted to show you guys this printer it's a label printer but it's very small as you can see that i got from amazon and i'm gonna open it up with you guys and we're gonna set it up together <clears throat> for me when i do my planning i like to i'm very big on motivation self-inspiring myself like literally my phone case is you got this <laughs> And then like right in front of me, there's a picture that says grow through what you go through. And this whole thing on my left has inspiration. Like it's not empowering to think you always, you can't always do more. It's actually exhausting. And then this one says, actually I can, y'all see it. So whenever I need inspiration, I just literally look over to my left or in front of me. It's always around me. So when I was thinking about this printer, the company had reached out and they wanted to send it to me i was like you know what i could print off quotes for the week and literally oh my gosh it's so cute I literally have it right at my desk this is so stinking cute so it says label printer here and then i want to say it already has a set of labels in it but girl let me grab the instructions that just fell because next thing i know we're gonna be here for hours trying to figure this thing out. I feel like there's an app that I do have to download on my phone, so let's see. Paper loading, turn the printer on first. So I just turned it on. Load the paper, so let me see. The paper is already set in here i'm just going to kind of start it yes it comes with paper we love that so let's see look like the elders i gotta put my my reading glasses on yes okay now i'm gonna go back just a little bit look i ain't trying to waste none of it so let me just go back just the hair all right, all right, so I gotta download this app on my phone. So let's go ahead and download this app. I love that it already has a little bit of charge to it though. Okay, it already print, it already found my printer. I don't know if y'all can see that. But this the setup is very, very quick. 
So the battery is at 59%. Oh, I love this. All right, so new label is what I just clicked. And then I'm about to type a text. Oh, that's cute. So you could change the font and everything. Oh, that's cute. Okay. It's a little blow dryer. Mm -hmm. Oh, you can actually add photos too. Okay, so this is cute. This is cute. All right, let's just print off my name. So this is the image that I want to print. And let's see if it does it now. Yes! 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 Okay, do y'all see it? Ah, super cute. Okay, I love that. So let me do my quote now for the week. Oh, this is cute. Thank you so much for sending this over. I think this is cute too if you like to plan. If you're a planner or if you are a business owner, if you like to label stuff like organizing, you can label your cabinets. I'm actually gonna probably end up labeling my, I think it's hard to cut. I'm gonna end up labeling my, um, this is just gonna be a test one, sorry y'all. But it is cute, it printed off really good too. I just messed up trying to cut it. But that's cute. That's cute. Okay, I love it. I love it. So let me try it. Let's do another one. Let's see. This is going to be up here. And then... This is cute. This is cute. All right. You got this. Yeah, let's see. I love all the font options too. All right, so then I'm gonna do prints. <laughs> cute, cute, cute. Oh, I love y'all. This is too cute. All right, so I'm going to link everything below. Definitely check them out. You can use different size labels as well. This is just like the custom standard label that come with that came with it. It also comes with a charger. And like I said, I opened it fresh out the box and it was already at 60% charged. So we love that when you can just get it out and start using it. And I'll show y'all um, how I'm going to use it. These labels for today, like this one I just printed off, I'm going to put in my planner. Y'all know I have like three or four planners. I'm trying to figure out which one <laughs> I want to put this in. Um, but you can purchase the labels on Amazon as well. And it definitely came quick, like it came next day, okay? And we love that. So yes, I'm gonna actually keep it on my desk. It's literally the size of my palm, like my hand. This is how small it is. So cute. So I'm about to go show my husband. <laughs> Cause I've always wanted a label printer. Ah! All right, y'all. <laughs> Thank you so much again to HPRT for sending this over. Love, love, love it. Very, very pleased. All right, so as y'all can see, I have not started planning for April yet, but I'm gonna go ahead and take the sticker that we just made and put it down here. At like an angle. Ah, cute, okay. Boom. That's pretty much all we got going on. So I'm about to play some music and vibe out. Also, before we vibe out, let me show y'all this book that I started reading today and I don't know if we're gonna get through it child it's not giving me much of anything let me take my glasses down I hate the glare so that's why I keep taking them on and off but it's called the girl on the train it's supposed to be about this girl she takes the same route to work or into the city every day on the train she notices this couple she gets really involved with them like she's giving them a name she thinks she knows what they do for work like she really just pays attention to everything she sees through the window, through their patio, whatever she can see on the train ride past. Like there's a stop that I guess is adjacent to the house. Anyways, come to find out a murder or something happens where the wife dies and she thinks that the husband is responsible for it. Like she saw something when she was on the train. So that's kind of the, the whole premise of the book. It sounds interesting, right? But I don't know. Like the actual, I only, I'm only one chapter in, but one thing about me, if I don't, if the vibes aren't vibing on the first chapter, baby, we on to the next book. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't always stick around. So this one is one of those. I'm like, eh, I kind of want to just move on to the next one. That's also the beauty of having a library card. You can literally go, go as you please. 
and y'all know I just did that book haul so if you haven't seen that it's in one of my vlogs I think two vlogs ago at this point but I have a bunch of books like eight books untouched that I really want to get into and then I have two more from this library run I think honestly let me go get the the other two books hold on y'all all right so one of them is called look what you made me do and this one let's see Carrie wants a normal life Carrie doesn't need a happily ever after she'll just settle for after after a decade of helping her sister hide her victims after a lifetime of lies she just wants to be safe and not trekking through the woods at night with a dead body wrapped in carpet Becca doesn't believe in happily ever after because she's already happy she's gotten away with murder for a decade and has blackmailed her sister into helping her hide the evidence what more could a girl want but first they have to stop a serial killer when 13 bodies are discovered in their small town people are shocked but not as shocked as Carrie who thought she knew all the details of Becca's sordid pastime. when Becca swears she's not behind the grisly new crimes they realize the town has a second serial killer who has the sisters in his sights and what he wants is Carrie that sounds real good I think I'm gonna start this one that sounds real good and then the other one I have is called the hearts we burn it's a romance y'all know I'm I'm 50 50 more like 40 50 oh, wait that's not 100 40 60 don't come from my math like, I promise I love math but I'm like 40 60 on romance so this one Kamara Davis thought she was finally free from marrying for money and living way too many lives until her obsessed ex-husband ignited the ultimate dark dark hoax a spectacularly malicious deception that's left her family and her best friend reeling now Kamara and her young son are prisoners at a remote estate under the thumb of her ex's powerful father and she only has one slender chance of escape suddenly Kamara is getting dangerously close to an unlikely ally but even she can't be sure if she's playing with him if that's what they or if what they have is real and there's no guarantee that her calculations and wild card moves will earn her and her son's freedom or cost more than her survival is worth. So, it didn't really give me as much as the first one. So yeah, I think we've made a decision, child. We're going to go ahead and put this train. It's giving the girl on the train, baby. Stay on the train. I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. But I've been loving this um, bookmark as well, which I got from a local shop here in town so yeah i'm gonna restart girl one of my to do's today was to start a new book technically i did because i started this one but now i feel like i need to at least read a chapter of this one sometime at some point today so yeah <laughs> but i'm about to plan for the week honestly for the month at this point too because it's april like i'm gonna try to plan out my videos for this month so this thursday coming up y'all will i'm sorry for y'all it's the last thursday y'all will see the wash and go video from pattern beauty love that video y'all saw my uh, results throughout the vlog from dc i loved those products like pattern yeah <laughs> you did your big one speaking of pattern let's open this package this one nail literally smudged but anyways let's see what we got from pattern beauty i'm really excited about this one y'all i already know what it is but <laughs> y'all don't girl Are y'all for real? This is the interchangeable curling iron. It literally just got released. Ah! It's like surreal that this is literally. Y'all. Super cute. So it's interchangeable. There's a 3 8 clip barrel, 3 4 a 1 inch, and then the actual base. Ah! I'm not going to open it just yet, but y'all think I should use this today? No, we, we shall see but it also has the storage bag and the heat protective gloves y'all it's the packaging for me like when I saw that blow dryer from pattern in that brown like tan color cream color my heart was just like oh it's so beautiful so the fact that I have this heating tool and I love that it has the clip like it's not just a wand curl it's an actual barrel and I'm a barrel girl 
I don't know if y'all are the same, like if y'all prefer to curl with a flat iron. Let me know actually, do you prefer to curl with a flat iron, a barrel, or just a wand curl? I am a barrel, like I need to clip, hold, and then release. I don't want to be touching stuff the whole time with my hands. That's just me personally, I haven't really mastered the wand. <laughs> but this is so, oh, oh I'm so excited. So yes, 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 yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, but like I was saying, so I have my pattern beauty video going out this Thursday. I'm trying to plan out my month. And then Sunday, I'm trying to give y'all vlogs every Sunday. Mm, that's a stretch, I know. But we're going to try. We're going to try for this month um, to do vlogs every Sunday. So this vlog that y'all are watching now is Sunday. Happy Sunday. I have my weekend. I'm looking at my calendar, but I actually can film this weekend. So that's perfect. And then I want to do a quarter one favorites. So I follow... Let me go back because I don't know if it's naturally Ray Ray or natural Ray Ray. Dang, where's her video? I'm going to find it and put it on the screen. But I just recently found her. Love her channel. She does natural hair videos amongst other things. But I've been watching a lot of her natural hair videos. And she did a first quarter favorites. I tried monthly favorites like a while back. But I realized I really don't have time in a month to really love on stuff. You know what I mean? Like I might have one or two things. And I'm like, oh, I really love that this month. But... As a whole, I feel like a quarter one favorites would be more realistic for me. So shout out to you for that idea if you're watching this. Yeah, I'm not about to talk to y'all. <laughs> Look, I'm not about to talk y'all through my whole process. I'm gonna just keep it in here. Um, yeah. <laughs> so. Yesterday I did get my steps, got my 12,000, but today my knees hurt, like, I don't know. I've been having to take ibuprofen literally around the clock. Like, it started last night, and I mean like hurting to the point where I can't stand on my feet for long periods of time. I'm just like, what is going on? Like, please don't take me back to 10th grade. Whew, please don't. Because that's when I had my surgery um, on both of my knees, so my cartridge, cartilage, cartridge <laughs> cartilage and my left knee was replaced because i chipped my kneecap and then my other knee i tore a ligament so they went in and did some repairs child so both of them are like probably at 75 percent <laughs> functioning um but we thank god that it could have been worse and it wasn't so I'm, I'm grateful for that but i need to figure out what's going on because number one I like to go out and walk and it's not even about the 12,000 steps like the challenge is, is it is what it is I'm not gonna jeopardize my health for you know what I mean like I'm not it's not that deep but <laughs> I do want to still be able to walk hello like hello so I hope I can figure out what's going on I really don't have an answer right now um so yeah on the agenda for today it's looking like possibly redoing these nails baby because what is this do y'all see that <laughs> what are those i don't know what happened i literally don't know what happened but i also don't really love this color so it gives me a reason to just take them off and honestly i may do i may end up doing gel x i don't know <laughs> i don't know i may just paint them regular with a different color i don't know tbd but i'll check in with you guys later because i am on a roll baby i will check in with y'all later i'm gonna be productive today my quote for today is only put off until tomorrow what you are willing to die having left undone hmm let me repeat for the people in the back only put off until tomorrow what you are willing to die having left undone second one nothing is particularly let me slow down nothing is particularly hard if you divide it into small jobs that was for me Sometimes you get, for me anyways, I get overwhelmed if I have like a lot of to-dos. But when I break them down into small, small tasks, it's doable. So I don't know who needed to hear that. But I hope that motivated you and inspired you as it did me. So I will check in with y'all later. Seeing you got ritualistic.
cleansing my soul of addiction for now Cause I'm falling apart Yep, tension Between us just like big defenses You got issues that I won't mention for now Cause we're falling apart From miles away, passive with the things you say, passing up on my own ways. I can't blame you. No. Passionate from miles away, passive with the things you say, passing up on my own.